Usually, in the past, you would have to go to third-party softwares and companies. So if you like shooting yourself in the feet, then stay where you are. But and until then, take action. Don't wait. Hey, welcome back to another video. I'm Jason from CelebrateDigital.com. So let's talk today about how you can connect with influencers slash creators so that you can start sending them your products for them to promote them. And obviously the idea is for them to start pushing your products so that you can get more sales to your store. So usually in the past, you would have to go to third-party softwares and companies and you know connect with influencers on a different platform and then figure out a way how to integrate that with your e-commerce platform so that you'd be able to pay out your affiliates accordingly and you can keep track of all that data. And it could be complicated and annoying. And I'm sure there is good softwares out there that can make this easy. But if you're using Shopify, you really want to use Shopify Collabs because it's going to allow you to do everything under one roof. And that's what's really cool. So if you're using other platforms um, to build your business like WooCommerce or BigCommerce or WordPress or Wix or whatever, you're making a massive mistake because you don't have the tools and the features to be able to, you know, help you grow and help you get more sales. So if you like shooting yourself in the feet, then stay where you are. But if you want to actually make some really big moves and simplify processes and make more sales, then come over to Shopify. You know, my creation isn't that scary. You'll figure it out. It's not that hard. They make it pretty easy for you on Shopify's part. So it's kind of like, you know, a, a one time a one time cry and then it's all over and then you'll be happy. So it's a lot, it's really worth it. If you are on another platform, come to Shopify. You won't regret it. Um, but Shopify has Shopify collabs and they rolled this out a little while ago and it allows you to connect to influencers. And so I'll show you quickly how to do this. Um, basically what you'd want to do is come over here to the Shopify app store. If you haven't had this app installed yet, click on apps. And then once you're on the app store, and you can also get there by going to apps.shopify.com, and then you install the Shopify Collabs app. It's the developer of Shopify, so you'll know that it's the right one. You can just take a look at that little logo over there. It's, it's, that's what it would look like, um, or over here, actually. Um, and then once that's installed into your store, then you'd want to come over here to recruiting. I might ask you a few questions just to onboard, but once that's finished, you go to recruiting, and then basically now you can start searching for creators. Now, not every creator profile is completely up to date. There are some weird ones that gets, you know, they get mixed in here, but don't worry about that. Uh, you, there's still plenty of really high quality people to work with. And how you would do this is you would go to social account. And now you have to figure out where your customers are. Are they on Facebook? Are they on Instagram? Are they a TikTok crowd? Are they a YouTube crowd? And so once you've figured out where your customers really hang out, then you can start looking for influencers on that platform. And so if you're looking for Instagram people, you come over here to click Instagram. If you want YouTube people and not Instagram, you would just, you know, unselect that and just check YouTube. And then you can do the same with TikTok, whatever. You can just go through here and see, you know, who comes up for what platform. Now, if we're looking at people who are on TikTok and TikTok only, now we have people who are coming up who have TikTok accounts. Now, the main thing is, is that when you're looking for creators, you want to make sure that their engagement rate is really high. It doesn't really matter at all if they're, you know, if they have lots of followers. Followers don't mean much because a lot of those followers are bots. A lot of those followers are inactive. A lot of those followers don't engage. And a lot of those followers just maybe don't even get um, those influencers' posts in their feed. It happens a lot. So the way to avoid working with someone that's not going to bring you results um, is to not work with people who have low engagement rates but high followers. Followers don't mean anything. Engagement rate means everything. Okay, engagement rate means everything. So um, once you've selected a platform, you can even select a location. Um, most people are probably going to be looking for people in the United States. Uh, it's pretty obvious. And then um, as a filter, you can even search for an audience size. Um, I would recommend micro influencers to medium influencers because large influencers like Kardashians aren't going to help you really, um, especially if you can't afford it, because they're very expensive. Um, but when you work at people from the 10,000 range to let's say even up to 200,000, you can start seeing some really big results with that. And so you can come here and you can do, let's just say 10,000 to 200,000. 
And now we have a list of people who are on TikTok that fit this um, audience size. You can experiment with this. You don't have to use these numbers, but I find that this could be most effective. Um, okay, so the most important thing after that is to actually then click on a category <laughs> that you that your products are in. So if you're looking for uh, fitness, then you just come over here and click fitness. If you are in the keto category, then you, you would just click over here and press keto. Um, I mean, name any category that you're in, and that's what you would type. If you want to do sports, here you have some sports influencers. Um, let's do cooking. Here are some cooking influencers. Here are some baking influencers. Okay, so now that you've found some influencers on the baking page that fit the, uh, the platform and is within this audience size, now you can click into your results and start seeing if they make sense for you. And so from here, this is their profile and you can click on their Instagram and it takes you straight to their Instagram page. You can see um, how they're doing. A good way to check if their engagement is good is to click on Reels. Um, it looks like she's not really getting anything. 102 likes. Doesn't tell us how many, no comments. and doesn't tell us how many views. For some reason, Instagram is glitching. I don't know if it's just for me or if it's for everyone, um, but Instagram Reels used to show you how many views people were getting. Um, now, it looks like they're not. So I'm not really sure what to make of that. That's a, actually a big problem because you do want to see how many views they get in comparison to the comments and likes. Um, so hopefully it works for you. Hopefully it's just a problem on my end. Um, but if it's not working for you, just give it some time in a few days. Hopefully you'll get fixed. That shouldn't be there. It shouldn't be a problem. Usually it's not the case. Um, and then you can also go to their TikTok and you can see, and you can see their metrics here and you can see how many plays they get, how many likes they get by just clicking on a video. And once you do your research by going through the profiles, then what you can do is that from the profile, you can invite the creator and then it will basically allow you to choose from your program. So let's just go through it right now. Let's, let's pick on, okay, now my settings went away, but let's just click on this person, for example. Now, if I want to invite the creator, what I'll be able to do is select a tier. And so I already went to the programs tab over here on the left and I created a program to be able to assign a commission to this influencer. Now I can have multiple programs so different influencers can receive different rates. I've also made it so that um, <clears throat> for my 15% commission, um, it's also recurring. And so if, if a influencer brings a customer to my product and they buy it, um, and because my product for this store, and this might not apply to you, but for me, it applied, where my products have a high repeat um, return rate, basically they you know people come buy them every couple of weeks um then that influencer for just bringing them once would receive a would receive a recurring commission off the product now you don't have to do that but that's a very big incentive for creators to make good content for you because now they're more motivated because now they know it's not just they're not making a video just for one sale they're making a video for lots of sales hopefully you know um a lifetime worth of sales if your products fit that category so um, you're able to select tier. Let's just do the 15% with the commission recurring, 50% commission with recurring. Um, and then basically it creates a, an affiliate code for them. And then what's really cool is that you can create a message and you can um, you know customize it for them. Uh, and obviously you want to take some time and really think about how to make a good you know opening message because you want them to look at it. You want them to get excited about it. And um, it's, you know, a very important thing. And once you've done that, then you just press here to agree. You can preview the invite and make sure it looks normal. And then you can just send the invite. Um, and then you might have to repeat this a few hundred times. And what might be easy is if you go through like uh, a VA and they're busy, you know, reaching out to all these people for you. Um, so you have to be busy with this. But if you have someone going through this for you, uh, you know, an hour or two a day, by the end of the month, you'll have hopefully hundreds upon hundreds of influencers of good, high quality content creators slash influencers that you've reached out to. And then from that, you should be able to get 
at least a 10% response rate. And you should be able to work with people pretty much right away. Um, you can also add a gift. So you can have like a welcome bundle. You can have some products that you send them immediately. You don't have to do this. I recommend not doing it only because unless your product is cheap and you could afford it. Because if you do that, then sometimes the influencers won't work with you. There, there is a problem with finding influencers that are like totally legit. Um, for the most part, they are, but every once in a while, they're not. And if you're offering a gift to hundreds of people, they might just take your gifts and then say, screw you. And then you're left without a lot of product. So find someone that's good, have them make some content for you, see that they make good stuff. And then you can send some, then you can send them some gifts. Just, I would wait on that. I wouldn't do that um, from the start. That's my advice. Um, and then it looks here that you can only send a hundred invites uh, a week, but you can always request to do more. And a hundred a week is pretty good. Um, but if you want to really go full force with this, just request more and go through that process. What happens if I do request more? Uh, okay, whatever. Brings up some stores. Okay. You'll make it go through a process. I haven't done that yet, but you can just figure that out. It's not that hard. And then their affiliate code. Obviously, this is, you know, this is pretty clear. Um, they'll be using their affiliate code um, that you made for them to be able to send traffic to your products. And so Shopify will be able to disperse payments automatically. You don't have to do anything. And that's the beauty of doing everything under Shopify's roof as opposed to going somewhere else where, you know, they have their own systems and it might not integrate so easily. Shopify is the e-commerce platform and now they have the, 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 the software to give you the influencers. So having those two things together under literally one roof is unbelievable. Now, um, your only job is just to go through um, all the recruits and to see um, who would be good for your brand. And so just make sure to follow the instructions that I just gave you, which is to type in your niche and then to find the social platforms that they're on. And then you don't really have to add that filter of the 10,000 to 200,000, but it could help just limit and give you more options that are relevant. And then importantly, just as a last thought, and I already said this, but I want to reiterate this, go on to their social platforms and just look at their engagement rate to make sure their engagement is really, really high. So Shopify Collabs used to be able to show you that. I don't know what happened. They had um, they had a graph showing you their engagement rate. They had more analytics on their profile. It looks like it's not here anymore. Uh, oh, it tells you in their engagement right here. I didn't even see that. So 1.6 million and their engagement rate is 1.79. You tell me if that's good. <laughs> um, I don't think that's the best. Just as another example. I mean, the, the Shopify Collabs analytics used to look a lot better than this happens to be. Maybe they'll redo this and fix it again, but it's really not that big of a deal. But their engagement rate here is 0 0.26, 0 .275, you know, not the best. If I go back into the baking category, I click on this lady. Look at that engagement rate. Not good at all. So you're going to have to go through this and, and find people that have high engagement. And they exist. I guarantee it because I've used people from Shopify Collabs. And I was very happy with them. So here, 6.8 thousand followers. So not a lot of followers, but high engagement. High engagement. High engagement. That is good. This is a person that it would be worth working with, except for the fact that she's in the UK. And if you're looking for someone in the US, then it's not really going to be so good. Um, but but um, you will find people who are in the US <clears throat> and that fit all the criteria if you just look hard enough. If you are a busy type of person, you don't want to be doing this, just go on Upwork or go on Fiverr or go on some other place and just have someone go through all the influencers for you and let them be busy with the vetting and the qualifying to make your life a lot easier. But Shopify has Shopify Collabs, and this is going to be massive if you can take advantage of this, if you have good products, and um, if the influencer slash creator wants to work off of the commission, which most of the time they do, especially for high-ticket products. So that being said, take action, get yourself on this platform, and now I want to show you something else that's absolutely unbelievable. And that is if you go to Shopify Summer Editions 2024, basically Shopify 
rolls out new, um, you know, features and new things that they're, whatever, the new features that Shopify is rolling out, they, they like to make a website about it and show you all the new cool things that they're, you know, implementing at the stores. And so you can go here at shopify.com slash editions slash summer 2024. And if you go to that link, you'll be able to see this page. Um, but if you scroll down and you go to, hmm, where to go? Right here. Tap into trusted YouTube creators. Shopify is rolling out. If you are on the advanced or plus plan, and the advanced plan is not that much, the basic plan is only $39 a month, and then it goes up to like $105 a month, and then the advanced plan might be a few hundred dollars a month. But if you're on the advanced plan, the plus is $2,000 a month starting. But if you're on the advanced plan, you'll be able to join YouTube Shopping Affiliates Program. And it's basically allowing you to enter into a network of verified YouTube influencers, creators, and you and, and they'll be able to tag your products in their videos. So this is a massive rollout. And I think this is super. I think this has massive potential. And I'm extremely excited for this to be rolled out. So not only do you have access for to this for free, right? Because this doesn't this 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 has zero monthly monthly uh, uh, cost. This is a free thing. All that all that happens is that they get a commission off of your sale. Um, but now they're adding into they're adding this YouTube influencer um, slash YouTube shopping feature for Shopify stores. So this is massive. This is a massive thing, and this is why you have to go to Shopify because what other platform is offering you all these crazy cool features? all these crazy cool things and integrations um, to help sellers grow. So if you're on some other platform, come on over. Don't wait. Don't be silly. You are really missing out on all the things that Shopify has to offer. And like I said, definitely go to shopify.com slash additions slash summer 2024 to see all the new features they rolled out. I would love to go through all this, but it would take forever and it would be boring for me to just talk it to you. I tried it in a different video. I deleted that video because it's just I'm not able to, uh, you know, make it interesting. So I wanted to just show you how to use Shopify Collabs. Remember, you would just go to Programs, create your program. It's so easy. Like you don't need me to tell you how to do everything step by step. Just go to Shopify, go to the apps.shopify.com, install the app onto your store. Um, once it's there, create your programs and just follow the instructions. It's super simple. And then under Recruiting, you'll be able to import and invite those influencers and have them sell your products. So when this thing rolls out, I'll try to give you an update. I'm very excited for it. And until then, take action. Don't wait. The longer you wait, you know, the longer you're just postponing, postponing the ability to make more sales. So get on it. Don't wait. And definitely start get, seeing more sales today. If you want any help with this, contact us at celerydigital.com. And um, until next time, Talk to you soon.